Hello everybody and welcome back to another video. I'm going to be doing another studio vlog. You guys enjoyed the last one so I thought I'd be doing more of them on my channel. And this one's going to be a bit shorter. I'm just working on something for my shop. I'm going to be adding these cute little clip-on flowers. I put this on my uh, channel story if you guys didn't see it but I'm excited to work on it and you guys can just see my process and see what I'm doing for today this is going to be a short vlog like I said because this is more of like a what I do in a day with you know my business but let's get to it so this is what I'm going to be adding into my shop these cute little flowers and it's made with these little clips that you can poke through and then bend them back so that they stay there I can't really see it well because of this but if you wanted to add this here like that just kind of as like a decorative thing or like to the cover of a journal maybe but that's what these are for and i really like them they take me a while to make but i'm going to be working on this today and ignore my desk because i've stained it but i'm gonna work on something for my desk as like a background so i'm excited to do that and i'm also gonna be putting some digital prints of these that you can like like cut out and like put together you know put together your little flowers so i'm gonna be adding the digital print of that on my shop if it's not up already but yeah let's get started so it's actually a few hours later and i just came back from the mall and ikea and i just got a few items from ikea um for my christmas journal spreads and i'm going to show you what i got also i got a new set of rings and i love this i thought this would look really really cool in the videos and these earrings which i'm obsessed with right now especially this one that's so cool but i'm going to show you the items that i got so i got these really cute washi tapes and i didn't even know they sold stationery there but this is like in the front like near the cashiers but i'm just gonna open these up and i love this one this looks very vintagey it's really cute and i'm gonna use these for my spreads today because i want something that looks a bit different and my spreads have just been looking a bit similar because i was using the same types of stationery but this one's really cute and i love this little fox one and i also got these little i thought these are memo sheets but they're not they're like sticker labels i think but they're really cute and kind of pull them out like this and yeah and I thought that would look really really cute Ooh, I don't think I can but these are the different designs but yeah so I'm going to be working on the packaging now because I just finished doing this like a few hours ago and I'm going to be working on the packaging so I'm going to do cute little like label things 
I got this, okay, this is like kind of wrinkly, but I'm using this as a reference, but I'm poking holes and I'm using this to kind of clip them through. And then I'll show you guys what they look like after. everybody so it is a while later and i finished working on my items that i'm going to be putting up on my shop tonight i'm actually going on vacation tomorrow so i couldn't make as many as i wanted to i only made about six or seven so i'm not proud of that but by the time i come back next week on monday i'm going to be working on this but i'm going to show you right now and i also made the packaging that i would be storing them in so this is out of parchment paper and i put this cute little stamp of this like plant because it's kind of like a flower themed product um this is still gluing here but i like the way it came out and so these are the products these are the flowers that i finished making and i'm obsessed my favorite thing is the packaging i love the little label that i made on canva and they just came out super super cute and i'm super happy with the results i'm gonna be making a lot more of them I didn't get to make as many as I wanted to today, but they're really, really pretty. I love these. And like I said, well, I can't show you a very good example on this because I have that there, but it's a paper fastener. So you just like kind of bend it back out and like take it out and then you can put it there if you want, like as a decoration. I don't know, maybe here like that or on a journal cover. Maybe, you know, you can get creative. You can use it for whatever you want but i love the way that it came out and i'm gonna have two different like designs i'm gonna have the one with um newspaper like this this um writing like the book page and then plain like this i really like this one this one's my favorite and i love the little thing this one's my favorite one i love that one but i'm gonna be working on a lot more and there's another item that i wanted to be working on for my shop and i'll probably do that for next week's vlog um but it consists of handmade paper I'm really, I love the way they came out and I'm going to be ending 
I should have maybe put this a little more down, but it's fine, whatever. Oh, by the way, it says here, handmade by journaling tail. And I'm going to put one of these in here just so you can see what they look like. And I would just take the back with a piece of washi tape because you guys can always use it, but this is what it would look like. And I love it. Sorry for all the noises, my windows are open. But this is what it looks like and I love it. I love the parchment paper, I've been loving it and I need to make a lot more packing, packaging things out of this. Yeah, I'm going to end the vlog here. It was a lot shorter than I intended it to be, but I wanted to have a video out for you guys this week, a longer one. And I was actually filming a video for this week, but I didn't like the way it was coming out. I'm going to refilm it, but that's why I did this studio vlog, just to have something out for you guys, like a longer video because I've been doing a lot more shorts. But yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed this video. If there's any other DIY stationery items you want to see me make, I don't know, stamps or anything like that, then let me know. But I hope you guys enjoyed this video and I'll see you all next week. Bye.